Yes, how about a little breakfast? Hi, it's me, Santa, again. I'm gonna show you my ass. Hey everybody, welcome back to the Peebs channel. We've done a lot of commercial reactions on this channel, and I don't think I'm being hyperbolic when I say I have a good time literally every single time. So we've got another one for you today, and it is another 2000s commercial video. Now, obviously, being born in 1990, I was alive and thriving in the 2000s, and also watching a lot of TV. So I'm hoping that I will recognize some of these commercials. Let's just jump right into it and see. Of course, let me know in the comment section if you recognize any of these. And why not give the video a like while you're down there? You know, why, why, why not? Alright, let's jump into it! <laughs> we gotta start on this one? Really? Wanna go camping for breakfast? Introducing new Kellogg's S'more Cereal. I'm sitting here rocking my brain like actually trying to figure out what the joke is with this so they're watching a video about someone camping while they eat their cereal but the video is just a kid stuffing sh shadows and stuff into his dad's mouth with the shadow i actually don't get it why are they watching this and why are they enjoying it so much and then he does it too wow <laughs> <laughs> classic i actually don't remember this commercial no so let's move on maybe we'll know the next one all I know is s'more cereal. Never even freaking heard of it. So maybe if you had a better commercial. If you had a better commercial, I could be eating it literally right now. You never know. Butterfly effect. Star and lightning bolt shaped chicken tenders. Yeah. I wonder where they come from. No, 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 no. Don't, don't cut to where the chicken nuggets come from. I don't want to see that personally. And trust me, kid, you don't either. Just eat your star shaped chicken nugget and shut up. <laughs> Yeah, they take the star and uh, sweet, squiggly shaped chicken and then they cut their head off and skin them and feather them. And it's gruesome. It's a. Uh, it's, uh... <laughs> Maybe not. I mean, y you asked. Anyway. This is a SpongeBob commercial, by the way. We've done these. We've done these toys. We've done these. We've done, we've done these toys. Look at the video. We've done these toys. Have it your way. I wouldn't do that. You know what happened last time. Airhead's extreme, extremely sweet, extremely sour. Oh my god, I remember this commercial. I remember one. Is this actually Shia LaBeouf? Extremely sweet, extremely sour. Airhead's extremes, extremely out of control. Mom, he's doing, doing it again. again. Why do I have space in my brain allocated to remembering that commercial? There's a great tasting new kind of baby. Like a baby bottle pop. That you can, that you can drink. We're so just less like a than a minute baby. into this commercial compilation video on YouTube.com. Uh, and it's already insanely cursed. Uh, so it's just like a real baby bottle. What does that even mean? Also, the baby heads. Yeah, that too. It's reminding me of my of the freaking Harvest Moon video that I did. I think it's actually a screenshot from Harvest Moon Magical Melody. <gasps> now Gogurt's bursting with even more flavor than ever. You're really gonna like it. New better tasting Gogurt. The grab and go yogurt. Do they still sell Gogurt? I used to love Gogurt. I would like suck on that Gogurt thing. <laughs> And it would like give me a sore on this side of my mouth because that's where the seam was. Yeah. Anyone know what I'm talking about? You have Gogurt and then like slice your mouth open. Like you're the Joker or something, basically. I want to know how I got these scars. My Gogurt. <laughs> Check it. Oh, dope. <laughs> Check this. Yeah. <laughs> I want to be like, what the. F why are there two men peeing on the TV screen? But honestly, that's pretty that's pretty impressive. Joe over here, he like stopped peeing in between the letters so he could get it right. Like that's dedication. I'm sorry. If you don't appreciate that, you don't appreciate real art. Also, what is this a commercial for? <laughs> oh, nice. oh my God, my God. Rayman 3, Hoodlum Havoc. We just saw Rayman's urine in a commercial. Official Rayman urine. <laughs> Rated E for everyone. <gasps> I remember this one. I remember that. Where's the 
the cream filling? Where's the cream filling? Where is the cream filling? Hey, there is the cream filling. Ah, ah, he said it. He said it. Hot take, sort of. All Hostess snacks are disgusting. They're just like overly processed, disgusting cakes. But if I was gonna eat one, I mean, Ding Dong is Ding Dong, right? Whatever the heck it is. They're the best ones. Worst ones, those brownies with the colorful, like little M&M looking things on them. Those are the worst, I'm sorry. Absolute F tier. Are those Ego waffles? Yeah, they are, Nigel. Have we forgotten something? It's nice to share. <laughs> You've got serious issues, pal. They go waffles. Dude, who would mistreat their stuffed animals in that way? That's atrocious. America's secret weapon. Sweet. This kid, I actually forget his name off the top of my head, but I remember he was really famous for a hot minute after uh, Malcolm in the Middle. Amazing show, by the way. And I think this was after Spy Kids had come out. That movie is ironically hilarious as well. I think this came out around that hype. I remember seeing him in this movie and then I literally never saw him ever again. <laughs> so this movie must not have done very well. Ah, this one's a twisted balloon. This party stinks. And there's no candy. See you around, clown. Crunch times. Are they admitting that uh, breakfast cereal is, is basically candy? Is that what they're admitting right now? Crunch times me, Captain. Dude, I miss Ronald McDonald. Bring him back. McDonald's, you cowards. Great parking spot, Ronald. Only a foot away. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't get it. Glad I got this dog translator. Uh, 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 uh. Now he's speaking my language. Now Fast food toys? Dude, who choice. gives a crap about that? Pokemon Ruby and Pokemon Sapphire, only for Game Boy Advance, rated E for everyone. I'm also probably the only kid uh, back in the 2000s that didn't play these Pokemon games. This is kind of when I checked out of it, to be honest. I was huge into Pokemon until around this particular time, for whatever reason. I eventually played Pokemon Alpha Sapphire on my Nuzlocke. I've heard it said, one of the best Nuzlocke's ever uploaded onto the internet. All right, chill out, please. Oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ, man. <laughs> Uh, wasn't my words. Wasn't my words. Star Wars. Yoda's Jedi power is in your Dude, I had so many of these, like, freaking lightsaber toy type toys. Oh my god. It was always the off-brand ones that were better, though. The off-brand ones were always more sturdy. Like, you could actually hit kids with them. Hooray! 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 That's all I have. That's all I have. <laughs> for that commercial. Where's the cream filling, Ron? Ron, where the f is the cream filling? You don't. Yes, seconds away from the all-time score. Sarah, breakfast! Is that an N-Gage? What is she playing on? I've got honeycomb. Honeycomb? Crunch your ties, me. I mean, me want honeycomb! Dude, I miss when cereal mascots were just like literal drug addicts. Can we bring back the drug addicts in the commercials? Come on, this pansy generation. No serial drug addict mascots? Freaking Zoomers, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Boys, how about 
a little breakfast. Hi, it's me, Santa, again. I'm gonna show you my ass. Dude, speaking of the serial mascots, I feel like the Toucan was was the outlier. He was like the only mascot who actually owned the cereal himself. Like, he had the cereal. I, every other mascot was just dying to get that cereal. Dude. They were like about to kill someone to get that cereal. Toucan just had it already. Uncle Toucan? Oh my. Why does he cover himself like he's nude? <laughs> I say, help! Here's our last contestant, Bonnie Ramon. I love Cocoa Pebbles, it's chocolatey! I couldn't come up with anything. <laughs> Give me Cocoa Pebbles or I'll break your knees! Ritz cracker pizza? Look, I love pizza flavored things, even crappy pizza flavored things, but like Ritz crackers pizza snacks? Is that what we're really doing right now? Dude, do those still exist? That sounds absolutely disgusting. I want, I want to try it. <laughs> I want to try the disgusting Ritz bit sandwiches pizza. What if it was the only roll left? What if? Love Dragon Ball Z. Get Ultimate Battle 22, the import for the PlayStation game console. <gasps> backyard soccer! Dude, this game is so good! Dude, I never had these backyard games as a kid. I would have loved them, though. I still love these games. I played some of these backyard games for the first time as an adult, and I think they're good. I have freaking backyard baseball emulated on my Steam Deck. The backyard soccer one's really good, though. We had a really fun video where uh, I played that on this channel. WWE Flexum. Holy crap! Dude, Hulk Hogan has such a great hourglass figure. Oh, these figures are actually disturbing looking. Oh my god. Smack down in the middle. Squeezed in the middle. Dude, I remember this. I remember literally that deep voiced guy singing that. Squeezed in the middle. I don't know why. The truth is real. Speaking of Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> Dildo, P Man, Gumbo Bumbo. <laughs> I actually did love that movie though. I mean, I I loved basically anything that Shia LaBeouf was in. I was a humongous Shia LaBeouf fan. So I never had cable until I was a teenager at some point. And I don't even know when Even Stevens first came out, but I started watching it when I was like in my mid-teens. I loved that show so much. I watched basically anything that Shia LaBeouf was in after that. I even literally bought the exact same wardrobe that Shia LaBeouf wore in the Even Stevens movie where they go to Maui. He had this yellow Hawaiian t-shirt with like a shirt under it. I got that exact same thing with khaki shorts. Was the only time I ever wore khaki shorts in my life. I've never worn khaki shorts in Zelda stuff. Stop outing me on Twitter about that. I've never worn that t-shirt. I've never worn khaki shorts. Except for when I wore it to Shia LaBeouf to be the, like Shia LaBeouf in the Even Stevens movie. All right, I never wore that. Stop tagging me in it. <laughs> I went on a little tangent there. Introducing a whole new ball game. Oh, Gax Blast! Gax Blast! Gax Blast back! It's back? Gax I didn't even know it was here! Gax Blast! Sold separately in the packages you see. Gax Blast! A whole new ball game. Gax Blast! Come on and come on and listen to a story about Wonder Ball. Dude, I miss Wonder Ball! I was collecting uh, these Wonder Ball Nintendo coins for a while when I was doing my doing them on live stream. And I would open them every now and then. I still never got Mario. Also, Wonder Ball, I remember it tasting good when I was a kid. It doesn't taste good anymore. The Peeps channel officially does not like Wonder Ball. To get two color tricks, yogurt, I'll be Mr. Party Guy. Here's another drug addict glorifying drug addicts on television. Can you believe the 2000s? Wow. Also, an adult hanging out with children just so he can get it fixed. This is disturbing stuff. Gags Block! Now, official Monster Jam action can come to your house. Can Jimmy play? Let him go down the ramp, lose, and you get slimed from head to tire.
<laughs> Dude, they loved slime in the 2000s. They were slime and everything. I, and like Nickelodeon and stuff. What was with the 2000s and slime? Sock and boppers. boppers! Okay, now this I obviously remember. I actually watched this commercial recently because we did our Nostalgia Toys video and uh, one of the toys was Sock and Boppers. If you haven't seen that video, maybe you should. It's in my shirt. It's in my shirt. Cut out the video. Videos up. <laughs> Hiker lost on What does it take to be a rescue hero? Your mother's credit card. Oh. Hot Wheels presents the World Race video. Some will fail, but for those who succeed, the rewards will be infinite. Dude, are some of these guys dying? I need to I need to get this VHS. I want to see these Hot Wheel dudes getting melted by lava to death. I'm interested in that. It's time to duel. Oh, Yu-Gi-Oh! I used to love Yu-Gi-Oh. I need to rewatch that show. <laughs> I mean, I doubt it's really gonna hold up, but just for nostalgia alone. Bites, extreme redeem, online Dude, Bagel Bites. I remember Bagel Bites. I was never actually ever... Lessons. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that effect. You can hoist your car to the top to get a better view because your friend controls a car munching alien that will suck you into the vortex trap. Well, why would Steve do that to me? Why would Steve control that alien whatever it was and, and kill me? Why would you do that, Steve? I thought we were friends. Will you be ready for the next alien attack? I won't be because I would never expect my friend Steve to do that to me because I'm a trusting person. Was that guy dead? <laughs> are they filming people that are like just laying there dead on the beach? What is this? This is inappropriate. Don't show it. Don't, see, don't show the sensual uh, things happening on the screen. We're not allowed to see. It's too sexy. On the island of Matanui, new ultimate Borok have awakened. Wait, on the island of Matanui? Isn't that the island in Moana? Did Moana rip off Bionicle? <laughs> Hashtag Moana is canceled. Some wanted banana yellow. Some wanted berry red. For the new tricks, please, everyone win. I'm sorry, no one wanted banana. Nobody wanted banana. I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, bananas in real life are good, but no one was asking tricks. Please bring bananas, tricks. Please. Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Another drug addict, by the way. <laughs> what do you care? You've got the goodness of Reese's peanut butter and milk chocolate. Get lost in a Reese's. Reese's actually is that good, though. That is genuinely how I eat Reese's. I don't eat them, eat them very often, but I will buy them every now and then, and I eat them just so slowly. It's like... Mm. Mm. They're so freaking good. Especially the Easter ones. I just bought a bag. It's been... I, it, 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 it. It's like he's trying to speak to me. I know it. This is how I am I'm thinking of this because I just ate one of those Easter Reese's in the car. I couldn't even wait till I got home. I ate it in the car and I was literally doing that. There was someone staring me over in the side of the parking lot. I'm just like... Mm. I like Reese's, basically. It's the point of this. Let's take a second check this room. Kids should have a place they can choose their food. A place just for kids to have tons of fun. And pizza prizes. Hey, you can come. I was going to go to Chuck E. Cheese's, but these kids suck so bad that I actually won't go to Chuck E. Cheese's anymore. I had my birthday planned for this year. Do you two go have a Chuck E. Cheese party? You are all invited, but not anymore because those kids suck so much. Have you seen Dora? Oh, there! Yeah! Boots wants to play too. Love my boots. Monkey dance boots. Sings and dances. Me swing from tree to tree. Love my boots. Yeah, my boots and me. Love my boobs, I love my boobs. <laughs> Check out this scientific bubble breakthrough. You can blow a bubble. Stick a bubble. Stop a bubble. Catch a bubble. Catch a bubble. The incredible mind bubbling. Catch a bubble. Harden in seconds and can last for days. This Justin, now scented catch a bubbles are here. <laughs> Smells great. That man should be arrested. Normally, I would believe in uh, innocent until proven guilty. I don't even know what he has done. I just know that he should probably be put in jail. Don't question. I, I just trust my intuition on this one. Send that man to prison. No man who loves bubbles that much should just be able to walk around in society. It's not safe, dude. I remember this. Is this? This is a freaking Lunchables commercial. I know it. I know it. I would bet every cent I have in the bank. This is a Lunchables commercial. We have the 
technology there with new lunchable I got it. Fuel. I freaking got it. Dude, I saw that commercial so many times as a kid. Why have we not done a lunchables video on this channel? That's what I want to know. If this video gets 5000 likes, we will do a lunchables video. Get the video 5000 likes, lunchables will happen. Let's guarantee. And go ahead and subscribe while you're at it. So you make sure you don't miss that lunchables video. I wish my allowance was bigger and I didn't have homework, but at least I can control my flip and dip push pop. Just flip the top and dip the pop. Your what? My flip and nip push pop. Your flip and nip push pop. But at least I can control my flip and nip push pop. Just flip the nip. That actually kind of hurt. <laughs> my nip. My flip and nip. What's the matter, Ronnie? Masculine itching? How'd you know? When I experience masculine itching, I reach for extra strength <laughs> itch stopper plus. How does it work? When your body heats up, Ronnie, enzymes mixed with bacteria can oh, cause God. unsightly discomfort. Boy, howdy, but with just two fingers of the patented I gotta go, dude. applied to the affected area, you can be swinging. I need to And skip this up, you don't want to see. I gotta go, guys. I'm having a little bit too much masculine itching. This video was fun and everything, but I gotta solve this massive masculine itch that I have going on right now. Three days later. My nipple still hurts from flipping it. Wow.